Hi, um, this is uh, 2018 Maths uh, Ordinary Level Paper 2. This is question 4 and it's um, a coordinate geometry question. So we have a point uh, on a circle, two points in a circle, we have a diameter of that circle and we have to, we're told that these are endpoints of the diameter. So we have to find the center of the circle W, which is somewhere over here. And we know that the um, center of a circle is always midpoint of the diameter. So uh, knowing that A and B are endpoints on the diameter, all we need to do is just use the midpoint formula, x1 plus x2 divided by 2, and y1 plus y2 divided by 2, to get that coordinates of um, the center are 1 plus 9 divided by 2, and 8 plus 0 divided by 2 which gives us coordinates of 5 and 4 for um, horizontal and vertical. <clears throat> then the next part of this question is to find the radius of the circle given the answer in the form p root q. So the formula for the radius, if you have a, which is distance of between two points, is um, root of uh, difference in the horizontal coordinates, x2 minus x1, all that squared, plus um, difference in the vertical coordinates, and all that squared again. So, um, assuming that the first point A with coordinates 1 and 8, and uh, center C has coordinates of uh, 5 and 4, we can say that this is going to be my x1, this is y1, this is x2, and this is y2. And I can use the substitution into my formula to find the result. So uh, distance from a to c is the same as square root of um, 5 minus 1 squared plus 4 minus 8 squared. Simplifying, it's a square root of 4 squared uh, plus minus 4 squared, which can be simplified further as square root of 16 plus 16, which is the same as root 32, which I can rewrite as root 16 multiplied by 2, which can be simplified as root 16 by root 2, and finally taking root 16 out, we ending up with 4 root 2 as uh, the answer to this particular question. So then we can write the equation of circle W, given that equation of a circle is um, uh, x minus the x coordinate of the center h squared plus y minus y coordinate of the center k squared equals to radius squared. Substituting, we're going to get x minus um, 5 squared plus y minus 4 squared equals to... Um, 4 root 2 squared and that's uh, that can be simplified a little bit further uh, by uh, saying x minus 5 squared plus y minus 4 squared equals to 32 when you square the bracket out. So then for the next part of the question we have to find the equation of the line that is tangent to the circle w at point um, at point A. So the line is tangent at point A, so I'm going to draw this line over here. Actually, let me draw a little better drawing here. So this line is tangent at C, at A, uh, which means that angle between A and line that's uh, containing the diameter is 90 degrees. So I can find the slope of this uh, of this line using the slope formula. So um, m1 multiplied by m2 for perpendicular lines is always minus one. So let's find mab uh, for line ab. Um, uh, coordinates are one and eight and nine zero. So uh, slope AB will be given by um, 9 minus 1 
divided by, sorry, 0 minus 8 divided by uh, 9 minus 1, which is um, minus 1. And then uh, knowing that um, MAB multiplied by slope of the line perpendicular equals to minus 1. So slope of the perpendicular line will be equal to minus 1 divided by slope of AB, which we can, I can substitute minus 1 for slope AB, so that's minus 1 divided by minus 1, which is equal to 1. So now I know that slope of perpendicular line is equal to 1. And I can use that fact to, calculate, to find the equation of that line by substituting into slope line formula knowing that the perpendicular line goes through point A. So uh, the uh, formula for point slope is y minus y0 is the same as slope by x minus x0, where x0 and y0 are coordinates of a point through which the line goes. So substituting y minus um, 8 is the same as 1 multiplied by x minus 1. And now you can simplify this further um, to say y minus 8 equals to x minus 1. And then moving everything to the same side, I'm going to get that x minus y plus 7 equals to 0. And um, that's the end of this problem, and it's a good place to stop.